What does Psycho Boost do? Eat kills your mon. Don't don't learn it. A hundred and forty. Oh, it's just. <laughs> this is just getting a little bit ridiculous now, isn't it? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to episode 18 of our Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green randomized cage match. I almost said unlock. That is not the series. It's, That's my it's, series. No, it's, unless you want to turn this into a solo <laughs> unlock. I mean, do you want me to go? Do you want to just leave yeah. it to me? <laughs> let's, just, let's just cut you out of the okay. screen. This is now an to. unlock. I'm not editing uh, the I'll video then. You can edit the video. I'm not, I'm not editing your no, videos. Don't do that. Okay. <laughs> so... How is everyone doing? Thank you for all your support on the series. It, um, we don't normally say this so early on, but I'm going to say it right now. Like the video Do if it. you haven't already. Make sure you slap a big, fat, early thumbs up on this video because mm. you're likely watching this in a premiere as we have been discussing and we think there will be a cage match <gasps> dun, dun, tonight. Dun, dun. Right now. Oh my goodness Ex me. I should have muted all of my Discord pages because I'm getting blooped, bleepity blooped Bleep, in my ear. Bleepity bloop Oh, I didn't fight or, this guy. Wait, what, what have I... Oh, there, there's my other mod. Right, okay. I'm just doing a, a quick team change around over here because... Uh, it's got to be done. Things will be... Oh. oh, by the way, that reminds me. Bald mentioned my Shininja is illegal. So... O yes. Over there you go into the death box. I'm not. At least my death box isn't all one color, unlike uh, Tommy's over there. Dude, your your death box, like, you've got a few awesome mons in there, but, like, yeah. mine is far more powerful than yours. Oh, de definitely, yeah. I mean, if I'd have got Swamp It, I would have been a very, very happy boy. I, I love Swamp It. One of my favorite mons. Mm. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, so, all right. Also, gang, here's the thing. So, I'm a little bit nervous because I'm not just nervous about. Uh, Professor Hoenn up there. I'm very nervous about the cage lock because I've been so I've been thinking about this all day, literally all freaking day. It's been bugging me. Like, I've been concerned about. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I've been thinking a lot about um, just what um, like what I'm gonna do for the cage match, who to send in, uh, and. Uh, and but one thing I keep coming back to is I'm also terrified of the Nuzlocke because your levels compared to mine are so your, much yes. better, actually so much better. They they are, and it's um, it's a good job oh. we we have that kind of rule in place where we don't have a cage match until both of us take on the gym leader. Because could you imagine if it was like you could just race there and go right and ready for the cage match, and the other person had oh, to do dude. it? It'd be absolutely yeah. brutal. Oh no, that isn't that isn't good at all. Uh, also, I, I I remember that you said there was a um a move tutor in here, and I know you told yeah, me I what did. floor it was last time, but I can't uh, remember it, oh. and I didn't do it last time. Uh, all I remember it's in the top left corner of one of the buildings. It's a, oh, it's <laughs> it's I think it's floor two, because I've just I've just gone past it. I think it's floor two. Take take oh. a look. If I actually, yeah, I, I was climbing my way up, but now you say that, I actually remember you saying it was a low number. Oh, there we go. Sorted. Come on, floor two. Oh, I see her. I see her. I've just got to get to her. So for those, where of, you at? So for those of you that hey. don't believe in the stress of a cage match, I, I just want to point out. Me, me and Tommy just had a quick conversation before the start of the episode. Tommy messaged me really early on this morning, saying you'd been up since what six o'clock, thinking about the cage match. What? Oh, oh, what does Psycho Boost do? Yeah, um, it kills your mon. Is, don't, isn't don't that like it's... Deoxys's move? Yeah, I think it boosts your attack or something. You know, because oh, you... okay, it, it, it's not like an actual attacking move, though, is it? Um, I'm not quite sure to be honest with you. I don't know. Oh, <gasps> it is. Oh, it's just <laughs> 140. This is just getting a little bit ridiculous now, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay, you're learning it. It's not 100% accuracy, but it? who else can learn it? Oh, my. Most of your mons. Teach it sevens. Go on. Go on, do it. I... Who are you going to teach I don't really know what I want to do with sevens. So, like, every time I come back, I'm just like, sevens, I'm just like, ugh. I just, oh. I've got such a bi I've got such a biased hatred towards Meganium. Why? <laughs> Why do you oh, hate dude, Meganium? I just do. I've just, I've just always disliked Chikorita. I've just always disliked that whole line of Pokemon. Thing is, Jamie hasn't really had anything, any moves properly, and he's got great special attack. That, but then, 
if I actually gave Zatu a good psychic type move, Zatu could be yeah. usable. So I guess for me, looking at your team, J it doesn't suit Jamie Jamie's typing. I don't feel. Uh, I I don't know what it is. Uh, yeah, like what situation is he going to be in where he needs to use a psychic? No, type he, move? he's he's not. You're absolutely right. Uh, decisions, decisions. All right. Well, we, that's the first move tutor used. Uh, okay, right. Khalil actually has a move. Pretty, pretty it good. Better than what, now let's get some levels my... on Celebi because I just really, honestly, need to focus on just grinding. Sadly, I'm not gonna. F I am um, because honestly, I was thinking I'm a little bit nervous about um, Giovanni. Have you like have you gone and taken him on yet? No, I I was just about to say, have you looked to see what level he is? Because I, I haven't looked, and oh. so I remember. So hang on, what? Because we we fought at the rival in the last episode, and his ace was forty. Now I believe Giovanni has at least a level forty, just from memory. Um, okay. I think he's got a level 40 purely on his own. Um, he might even have like a 42, which means he'll be like, they'll be well in the 40s. And for you, I think you can take him on no problem. Okay. It's just me I'm slightly concerned about. Right. Because, because and, and it's literally just the fact that you have like, I think you've got like over 10 levels across the board that I don't have. Which is mad when you, when you think about it. And I'm not quite sure... I'm not quite sure why, to be honest with you. I don't know. Um, I think, well, because I spent a long time training up Dugong, and then yeah. I obviously replaced Dugong with Lapras, so I, I lost about, like, I lost about 12 levels there, I think. So that's probably um, why, then. One of the reasons why. Yeah. yeah. And, um, no, and to be fair, you've had more recent deaths than me. Other than my Heracross, I haven't lost a Mon to the Nuzlocke in quite a while. So you had Feraligator yeah. that died, you had, um, you were pointing levels into Magikarp that died, Bagon died... There was, there True, was... and then of course there was um, uh, I, oh, I used him for a long time. The executor, I well not uh, a long time considering, yes, yes, yes. but like at least an episode and a half. Yeah. Oh, and the Dragonite as well. Although you didn't really train the Dragonite, did you? So ah, the, the, the Dragonite was there for like just to look pretty. I think at the end of the, he... at the end of the day, <laughs> he looked pretty until he took a twisted to the face or a dragon claw, whatever it was. Ooh, savage! And, he's, and now he's gone. Yeah. So, so uh. by the way, to Tommy was up this morning. I couldn't sleep last night thinking about the cage match. It's 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 just taking over our our lives. <laughs> to be honest, it really is. We need to. If you ever do a cage match, don't just uh, don't. Just, just, don't. No. <laughs> just don't ever do a cage match. If you are an aspiring YouTuber watching this years from now and thinking, I'm going to do a cage match, don't. Do a soul link. Do a, do a race. Do a versus. Do something relaxing. Uh, you know what? Sorry. I actually... I'm just... See, this is why I lose a lot of mons. I, I, I definitely lose more mons than the average PokerTuber. But I'm just so... I hate grinding. I just yeah. think it's boring. It is, so yes. I am... Um, gonna ignore gonna, my own heed and i'm just gonna, gonna take on I'm giovanni gonna go. aren't you i'm uh, gonna take on giovanni i'm gonna get myself a master ball okay fair enough uh i and well if i die i die but i, I back my boys you did i go this. to the pokemon center or am i you did didn't yeah i saw you heal Can okay we... good uh, th see this th this is literally like this has just frazzled my brain for today what what i'm sorry so we're gonna fight this dude what's frazzled your brain oh this is not a good start <laughs> At least it's level 38 I can handle. 38 I can definitely handle. That's not Giovanni, is it? No, no. Oh, no, no. Right, okay. no, This is the guy before Giovanni. <laughs> See, honestly, uh. because, all right, so, right. Well, let, let, we'll talk to the viewers about this as well. So, I, so, again, I spent most of the day thinking about, and Hohen said to me, for this cage match, he actually hasn't damaged Calc too much because he came to the conclusion that, no matter what he damage calcs, like one thing can beat one thing, but yeah. then yeah. it doesn't beat another. So you end up going around in circles. And that's exactly what I've done. But I've done that. So I've basically, I've shortlisted four of your Pokemon that I think you'll go out into. Yeah. Um, whether they're in your team or in your PC. Because that's, I, I haven't, I've barely got any of your natures because no. you have been, I don't know if you're doing this on purpose, but you've been a sneaky no. boy. So, uh, you... so it's been the same for you. Like I've had to go back several episodes to find out the natures no. on some of your mons. Uh, so I think, yeah. 
I think we just both not reveal it. Like, it's yeah. not something you talk about. You talk yeah. about it when you get it. <laughs> not and, for, mm. and that's it. And then, yeah, of course, and like, do you really want to, like... I'm not going to watch every single episode no. through yeah. again to see if it's going to work, but yeah. Uh, um, so, yeah, I've essentially come up with four, and then I basically... So then I picked counters to all of those Pokemon that mm -hmm. I could think of. Then I started thinking, okay, how do those Pokemon fare up against the other ones? And I sort of just whittled it down to the point where I'm like, okay, this one yeah. is, stands like the least amount of chance this one has. But yeah, so I, for once... I'm actually gonna say, I have a plan. You have a which, plan. Oh. See, mate. See, this is how, look how you're feeling right now is how I feel every single time we talk about this. You hear the person say they've got a plan, and your heart sinks. It's like, oh, just okay, a bit. okay. The thing is, though, I, I yes, you have a plan, but I I know the majority of your team. I know what um what um. What moves you've got? I, I don't necessarily know the natures, but again, when I've been damage calculating, I've just literally gone, "What? What's the what's the nature that's the best for them?" So, like your lantern, I can't remember what its nature is, but like I've just put it so like it, it's its nature is increased special attack because chances are that's that's gonna cause me the most issue so oh wait so you give yourself like the worst situation yeah, for you yes. so it, if it's not that it will go better that exactly. yeah actually that makes a lot of sense exactly i just think that's actually, i think I, i've done do. a similar thing i've done a very similar thing in into to for that in the past for you actually mm. just to just to so okay so this, this is got. giovanni by the way i'm not going to speed up for giovanni no okay. so this he baton passed into a yanma i think i have this uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna would. Oh, but dude, I've pro played this. Yan mate went for detect, and I went for future sight. Ooh, got it good. Okay, I'm interested to see what happens here. Uh, Sizzle's coming in. I probably can't do oh, that much damage to that. I'm okay. I'm okay. Interesting. You've put Slicey Dicey back on the team. I have. Interesting. <laughs> probably not for the reasons you think, though. Because, huh. I've, I've, like, for me, like, winning a cage match is also about which which mons can i afford to lose as well yeah i <laughs> don't I've, I've been thinking that as well it's funny because um so, actually so sorry finish what you were saying yeah because there's some mons on my team that i'm looking at that i'm like i don't want to lose that mon like sizzle for example has full swipe i do not want to lose that mon because that if if i come across a legendary pokemon getting it to one hp is like one of the best ways to catch it so i want to keep that one alive same with tyranitar i don't need to send that into a cage match because the move set it, it gets is that good on its own i don't need tms on it but then some of my pokemon are like duplicates of one another like the type of role that they fulfill so it's like i could send mm. one of mine i don't really need to worry about it on, what were Equally, you that Tyranitar, I mean, that Tyranitar is like, it's, I don't have a lot for it. Like, I don't really have, a, I don't have a grass type move. So, well, um, no, but you have Lantern in, and I, it, yes, it, the, but there's it, go <laughs> is the case of, do I want to, do I want to lose Lantern? Do you want to Dugong, lose Lantern? Dugong and, La Dugong and Lapras are weak to your rock stab. They are true, true, true. So uh, the, the, these see, like, these are the thought processes that we go through, and it's horrible. It really because is. Every, every time you think, ah, this kills this, you go, actually, wait, but that yeah. kills that, and yeah. oh god, it's an endless cycle of pain and misery. Uh, it kind of ultimately the the, the, ca the cage match ultimately just comes down to who you send out. It's as simple as that, and that pretty much decides who who wins to be honest with you you know what yeah. would be quite interesting to do a cage lock but instead of it being a one-on-one -on -one, it's a two-on-two -two cage match every time that would be quite interesting like throwing out some of the bringing out some of the strats yeah okay but do you lose two mons at a time i'd probably say you or like whichever mm. one goes down first so is then is it a game where like you're trying to protect one of your mons over the other like potentially but, but then but then you throw the, but then you run the risk of like potentially someone just sacking off a pokemon well yeah what it could be though is you could have to, so you both send out two mons and um the winner gets to decide one of your mons to knock out so they get a pick and they get to say right you sent out lapras and dugong you're getting rid of the dugong you could do it that way perhaps yeah, actually, no. That, that that that's that seems like quite a fair way. Mm, because the problem um, is, like, in a in a that kind of format, 
if you've only got two mons and you lose one in a cage match, suddenly you're like, oh no, this isn't this isn't looking too good at all. Hey, you you've easily taken him mm. down. You've got this. Yeah, he, right. he, he's he's gone. He's done. Um, also, because I mean, as much as Dugong and Dugong and Lapras, I, I'm very lucky. Dugong and Lapras are both very good Pokemon in their own rights. They are. Um, one is arguably better than the other, um, but. Because they're both the exact, they, they pretty much have a very similar move set. They both have the same typings. They can, they, <laughs> like, I'm sort of of the case of like, if I send one in, yeah, and one dies, yeah, it's not the end of the world yeah. because I know that I've got like the second one exactly. sat back. But, <laughs> uh, but then it's a case of do I. Do do I wanna like which okay in, if I'm if I'm prepared to lose one which one am I yes. prepared to lose? Because part of your because um, like you could send out the stronger one Lapras which increases your odds of winning but if you lose it you're left with the weaker of the two. Likewise, if you yes. throw out the weaker one which you're prepared to lose, it might lose a cage match which the Lapras would have won. There's so much just goes into this. It's just boom. so so freaking true. <laughs> Hang on, actually. So, oh, so. Also, I remember there were actually encounters that I don't believe we went back and got. I don't think either of us fished at Pallet Town or <gasps> you're right. Viridian City. No, you're absolutely right. Um, yeah, I don't know why I'm trying to surf. Because yeah. I am. I'm, while I'm just kind of waiting, I am going to do that because there's no mm. reason not to really. Doing Whether so. this will change anything, who? So who knows? Is there any others? There's those two. Do I, think, I have balls? I think that's it. You've, I have balls. You've got a master ball, you're fine. It's a yeah, weedle. I mean, if ball. I don't have to use it, I don't <laughs> particularly want to. Dude, oh. I'm, I am hoping in uh, to make up for the massacre that happened to me in episode 16. I'm yeah. praying that my Zapdos encounter is, is, is a Rayquaza. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, that's not bad. That's, That's not bad. pretty good. I mean, it could teleport. Mm. So we're going to go for a T-Wave. Okay. You'll... And hopefully it doesn't. Yeah, okay, well, that was short-lived. See ya. <laughs> see ya. <laughs> that, that was the biggest see ya that I've ever encountered. Okay, <laughs> Pallet Town. My oh. hometown. Yes, yes, yes. See, I normally surf there, but I never... I don't know why. I've never thought about using the rod. Not even a nibble. That's why. Well... I believe the rod is... There'll, there'll be a higher level than surfing, which is why I'm going ah. for the rod. All right. I think that's Giovanni done. Uh, and su speed. Super rod, they're like low 20s. Another ice type. Eh. I know. mean, it's better in Generation 4. Right. Because you can get a Frozlass. Mm. Glalie... Is not all that, to be honest. No, I mean, it's not bad, but I'm pretty sure it's a physical attacker, and of course, yeah. I mean, I'm oh. gonna name this Snorunt. I'm gonna call the. I'm gonna call you Run Runtella. Runt Runtella. Ooh. Oh, where where can we get? Wait, why did you just go like ooh? Where did we get Ultra Balls from? Um. Oh, I forgot about her. Um, <gasps> I can only return. Hey, that's not bad. A very powerful normal type move. Oh, that's crazy, dude. Um, Ultra Balls, Celadon Mart will have them if they don't have them in Saffron. How would we? Do you not okay. have to give her the Poker Doll, or does she just? No, you have to give her a Poker Doll. So, how? Wait, did you? What, I, is it any old Poker Doll? I just, or is it I a just, specific one. I just picked one up at some point in my adventure. I did a bit of research. I was like, oh right, I can go to her now. Return. Oh, that's so not fair. How would re how would return work in the cage match? Like, would we just put the friendship to maximum? I'm not quite sure. I actually don't know. It might do that automatically. No. Right. Um, uh, I am not sure. I'm not going to am... stop trying to. Yeah, I, I don't need to learn it now. I can come back for that one at some point. Because the last thing I want to do is... is I, I want to do a bit of prep and figure out who the best Mon... It's a shame Uproar can't learn it, but... no, oh well. Oh, I, that's why I can't fly. I'm being a, I'm being a mess of gooseberry. Oh, 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 oh. Gooseberry? Uh, Check I'm, you I'm, out I'm, with your fancy fruits. I'm being a... Ma I've I don't even know what a gooseberry is. <laughs> what is a gooseberry? It's just one of those things, isn't <laughs> Have you it, never had you? a gooseberry before? No, I've never had a gooseberry before. I'm not uh, I'm not the biggest fan of gooseberries, but I've, I've eaten a gooseberry. What, what, what are they like? 
Uh, a little, a little bit. Uh, are they sour or bitter? I mean, they're very. They're, those are very opposing uh, tastes. Yeah, um, yeah. I th- well, welcome want to, to say they're a bit bitter. Welcome to our latest Kajok episode, where we will be brewing a variety of fruits and appetizers. Um, yes, oh, this is what you came here to see. Exactly, that's what the people the fr- want. Le fruit spectaculaire. Um, all right, so I'm I'm a savage. I'm just going to go to Koga. Okay, well I will be not far behind you. I need to. I want to get those two encounters that you just got, just to just out of curiosity more than anything. Um, I, just, I need to gauge these levels. Why has everyone got lavatars and freaking? Fr- like. Oh, and I. It's almost like you know that the the trainers know who is coming into the next cage match. They know. They know, Tommy. Listen to them. <sighs> There's been a t- I'm uh, I'm not even gonna say that. <laughs> oh. Pokemon can Not lose. even gonna say that. Uh ba, ba, da, no, I don't want uh, nope. Yes, right, okay. Let's fly to where am I flying to? Come on, Yami, all aboard. Um, you know who we should send into a cage match? We who? were we were joking earlier on about me sending in audition, you sending in Sunku, and we should send out Yoin and Yomi. Just to yes, just we to, should just to see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I said I said to Hoenn privately. I said we should just send out our weakest mons like Oddish and Sunkern. Yeah, and just like a battle of the battle of the plants, really. Just to see just to see how how badly they both are. <laughs> Oh god, I'm getting, I'm getting conf. Oh no, I've got to stop. I need to grind. He's gonna have level forty sevens. Hmm. Uh, I mean, yeah, sure. I'm not gonna say no to that. Is that not dupes for you? Oh no, you didn't choose nine tails. Did I you? didn't know, but funnily enough, um, British Eagle mentioned about. Oh, you should have picked that one for because it has confused Ray and and all this other stuff. And I was like, all oh, right, well, a bit late now, but. I've got a second. I've got a second chance now, so I can throw an ultra ball. You know what? I might actually go and get a firestone just to um. Mm. Whoa. British. Whoa. I'm gonna call this thing British, even though I'm probably not gonna use it because whenever I do use a Pokemon called British, I kill it. So uh, maybe I'll just send it out sound. into the cage match just for the lols. <laughs> into you, in you go, British. <laughs> Happy death. <laughs> uh. Uh, <laughs> right, let's use the super rod again. Oh, come on, give me, give me these mons. Not even a nibble. I'm getting nothing. I'm getting absolutely nothing. I don't can... even know where the best place to train is. I got ballsy over here. Wow, a cast form. Yay! That is <laughs> really bad, Game. actually. <laughs> Game changer over hey, here. Stab strength. Them. Pardon? You never know. You n- Stab strength. It, it, ooh, yeah, exactly. Here we You're go. gonna beat me. Oh, we didn't didn't actually stay in the ball. Oh, this Pokemon. Wow. It does. It doesn't even want to join you. I mean, that's like. I hope like you feel the, disrespected. I, I do. I feel like it's rubbing its balls all in my face. Oh, blimey! Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> that was. I thought that was more graphic than I was expecting. To be honest. <laughs> <laughs> What is happening? What is happening? Ballsy, welcome. Uh, after, again, after the episode you sent me earlier, uh, I was looking at the thumbnail. I was like, why is there an eggplant in the thumbnail? I was just like, I was like, what? I was like, what on earth? What, what on earth were we talking why? about? And then literally the intro. And then, and then of course, just the X-rated stuff's coming up. And I'm like, what? Oh. What? Like, oh, oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, That'd be why. Now, do I like oh. the idea of flinching or do I like the idea of never missing? They're both the same. They've both got 60, haven't they? 60 attack power? Yeah, but yeah, but um, it's the thing, like, if I get sand attacked, faint attack is... The, I'm going to I'm gonna keep bite, yeah. to be honest. Actually, I like the idea of the flinch, because if, if Jamie ever uh, comes up against one of your mons in battle, uh, it would be hilarious to flinch you, so... No, yeah, because you don't have enough RNG luck already in this series, you know? Just that oh, that's extra. rich coming from you, sir! <laughs> yeah, We've I... had... P- we have shared the Runga... We have. Uh, equally, I do believe. You have to share the ringer, otherwise you will be in trouble. Uh, kids, if you're watching this, share the ringer. Um, <laughs> share the ringer. You know. uh, on the playground, <laughs> give that ringer to everyone. <laughs> oh, share the ringer. And if your teachers tell you not to share the ringer, don't listen to them. Rebel. Yeah. Where's... You know what they say, don't be a minger, share the ringer. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> right. Uh, uh, when was the last time you heard that word, minger? I... <sighs> 
Is that even a bad word? Should I? It's not, right? No, no, no. That, that can, was going you can, around you when you're like eight you years old. I, uh, everyone used to say that at school, at high school. Was it the same yeah. for you? Hang on, I look at my camera. Do you, do you remember the, the, like, the whatever, Minga? Yeah. <laughs> so forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's bring it back. Yo, Let's bring you, it back. If you know that, if you know what I'm talking about, just Lee, just be like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I'd just leave a comment, but oh. like, oh man, that was, those were the days, man. You get called a minger because you've got like a cheese and pickle sandwich at school and they're like, oh, you're a minger. Oh, like, hey, mate, I like cheese and pickle. What's your big deal? What, why are you, why are you, why are you busting my balls oh. over there? <laughs> <laughs> I love this. Man. <laughs> this series is so funny. <laughs> we spent the first ten minutes like complaining about how much we, how what? much, how much we. What? Uh, what, what's up? Hang on, sorry. Um, I just need to. Whoa, whoa, what's going? What's Illumise just flattered me. Which is lovely. Um, and then I, I, I just I made a silly mistake. A silly, silly we gooseberry, a full heel. gooseberry mistake. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, well, I don't understand it. So it flattered me. Yeah. And obviously, flatter does the opposite of swagger. But it still did a load of. Da I wonder if it's if you use a special type move and you hit yourself, then it does greater damage. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I maybe I don't I don't know. To be honest with you, I, I am gonna. Know. Oh. I'm going to have to go out. Unless I've got this insanely wrong, but I mean, oh, I think it is kind of a case, kind of the case that the gym leaders in this game notoriously have much higher levels than their uh, their trainers. Mm. I, tell, I tell you what, where did you get up to only like the first trainer or two? Oh, I've beaten all of them. Oh, you've beaten all of them? Jesus. Yeah, but they weren't that hard. Like, oh. I don't think one of them had a level 40. Koga's got a level forty, surely. He, he, no, he he like he should have a level forty-seven. Right. Like I'm almost certain of it. Right. Forty-seven. I, yeah. I mean, I'm even. I'm actually even tempted to go and take on like Sabrina's trainers again. Not Sabrina, but just her trainers, ah, just just for the experience. That's not bad. Actually, that's not that bad makes shouts. a lot of sense. Do it because. Because they're they're pretty much the same level in terms of gym leader. Yeah. So it makes sense to like use their train all their trainers as grinding material. Yeah, it does. It does. I think you're absolutely right there. Do it. And I'm I'm actually I'm gonna be playing this dangerously because I don't have time to give sevens or Khalil XP. I've tried to a little bit, but oh, it's just gonna it, it doesn't make sense. No, ju I just focus on Jeff, Sally, Jamie, and Dark. And to be fair, I'm, if you have to drop one yeah, of them from training, drop Sally, I'd say, because Jeff is just Jeff's a high level. How well do you? Yeah, no, I'm. I'm literally. I'm. I'm not. I'm not even going to bother with um <clears throat> with Sally. I'm just going to go with the with the three team. Yeah, yeah. So, do you know your way around Sabrina's gym, or are you are you going to get lost in there? Um. Well, that's the thing. I I I, I can tend. I tend to be able to do it pretty quickly. But considering that I'm just going for the trainers, I'm yeah. not really going to be doing the way that I would normally do it. Right. Okay. See, I. I don't know what. Go on. Sorry. But just what what levels do you think you're going to get to? In in this in, in this when, when just in this yeah episode, like what what levels are you gonna like go for? I I'm ready to take on Koga when you are. I I, I feel there's, oh fair there's, play. there's nothing there's nothing on my team that I'm 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 taking on all the trainers, but it's more for the money more than more than anything. To be honest with you, um I don't feel like I'm sorry. What are your levels again? What levels am I? Um twenty seven yeah. thirty six forty one forty one twenty eight. 42. So my levels aren't like Yo, massively... you are really not using that Tyranitar. I was great grinding it a lot last episode. Um, it's because... It, uh, I know this from doing my challenge videos. It's in the slow XP bracket, so it takes forever to level up. So I'm a bit like, you know what? I'll... I'll focus on a few other mons first um, for now. Yeah, that, make, that makes sense, to be fair. So, yeah. I, don't get wrong. Like, that Tyranitar... It's probably going to be in my final team because it just, yeah. it's, I mean, it's a Tyranitar. I'd be daft not to, wouldn't yeah, of course, I? Like, yeah, I mean, as much as it would be nice to have items and stuff on it, there's nothing yeah. making you. No. Not at no. all. Exactly. I mean, but it's one of those mons that, to be fair, it's the, the levels it learns its 
better moves like Crunch and Earthquake. I don't think we're going to have a cage match before then. Um, uh, before it learns. And it's almost like those levels I'll learn on the way to probably Victory Road or something. So, but, but we'll right. see. We'll see. Oh, great. So this Mon has Arena Trap. Yay. Okay, fine. Fine, 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 fine. fine. I'm just going to kill it. I'm just going to kill it instead. Knock it out. Oh, Another Snorlax, are you serious? Don't lose another Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm encountering quite a few of these, and yeah. they're still a bit of a nuisance. You've got this. You, you would think so, I, ho you? I hope so. I don't want you to lose this this late on in the in the game. I mean, it's not used belly drum yet, has it? I don't think so. Oh, God, I need to get this power off me. The, the fact it's level... Th I actually don't think it has belly drum. No. I think I think it's like over leveled to the point where it doesn't have it anymore. Oh, okay. Which is oh, that's nice. A, that's a bit annoying. Come on, come on. He's, he's, he needs you. to pull his weight. Good for me, yeah, definitely. But still, to be fair, I I don't think we'll be losing oh, wait, any more monster than Nuzlocke. I, I just don't. I just I can't I can't see it happening now. Maybe Giovanni. I can. I I'm I'm I know I'm gonna lose a mon. You know. Especially now that you've said that, you've like destined one of my mons to die in like thirty seconds. <laughs> in the next Watch battle. it. I'm gonna. F oh wait, wait. Actually, I think Third. this is. Actually, this is the last trainer of Sabrina's gym for me. Oh. So I might just have to go for it. You you might just have to otherwise we're gonna be here like forever grinding. Yeah, and we did say we would have a cage match this episode, so. Yeah, you can't, we can't let the right, folks no, down. They won't be very happy. Now I just need to work out how to get out of here. You, you got oh, wait, is that... Out. Oh, have you taken on the trains on uh, Bicycle Road? Yep. Oh, wow, you've, I've not done that. I'm pretty you? sure I've done I've done it all. Right, you've done it all, eh? Yeah, oh. I de definitely wasted a lot of experience on some of the mons I let go down. Right, okay. That would be and we're at 32 minutes, so this is probably a good time to take okay. on a gym leader. Fair enough. I will finish this okay. battle, and What's then I will... What's my plan? Uh, you're not using by No. Think... Fantastic. Down you go. See you later, alligator. And then... Oh, come on. Are we, are we taking them on at the same time? Are you just going to go straight for it? Uh, I'll wait for you. I'll wait for you. Okay, sounds. Okay. Uh, there we go. Right. Battle dawn. Uh, where's my... Get, get, get your butt over to the gym. Oh, I haven't got Yomi on my team. I should probably... Did, did you just teach a HM to, a TM to a Pokemon? No. Oh, okay. HM. I was just I was just looking over and I, I swear I saw the, like, the CD icon and whatnot. No, well, you, you did, but it was a, it was an HM. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right, uh, I missed that. If that comes back to bite me in the bum in the cage match... I'll be kicking No, no, it, it, it's for it's for I don't know why I'm telling you, but it is for Nuzlocke purposes. <laughs> yes. Oh, is he right? Okay. We're about to, we're about to need uses of HMs. Okay, right. You ready? I'm ready. You ready? I think so. I'm gonna I'm gonna save my game just in case. Okay, right. I'm just gonna jump straight in there and kick his butt. Oh, apparently I, I spoke to him on accident. Good luck, buddy. I don't. Want, I want you to get beaten by me, yeah. not Koga. Best best of luck to you. I wouldn't mind you losing one or two mods in the Ace process. Train still, of still forest. Yes, four months. Oh. A Larvitar! What is going on? I'll tell you what, it's a good job we didn't set the pre evolutions a little bit lower, otherwise, you'd be fighting, oh. I think, two Tyranitars in episode, maybe three? Maybe three, wouldn't it? I, I, well, I, I think I, I've, I've fought a, I fought two Larvitars and one Tyranitar this episode. Oh, I might have just made a huge mistake. Oh, my good God. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's oh, fine. wow. Oh, he is such a beast. He is. Thing. He's such a bulky boy. Look at that. A fighting type move, and that's all it did. All right. So far. <sighs> so far. Oh. Two Mons have both been four times weak to water. So oh, Jeff okay. is once again oh, no. pulling me through here um... by, my, by the scruff of my neck. This should Oko easy town. Jeff is just a powerful, powerful boy. Look at him. He's just, like, so happy. He is. He's, he's, little, he's, just, like, he's just chilling, isn't he? Yeah. He's just a happy he's little boy. He's just, like, a big smile on his face. Wool rain. He, we've got stabbed for that. Oh, you got a ho on your team. I mean, uh, not in your face. You it's not on your team. If wish... it was on your team, I would be. It, it, I would have been. I would have been. I would have been the one with no sleep. Last yeah, night. <laughs> it, it might, yeah. Having a legendary, a proper legendary on the team, which will happen in the next next couple of episodes. We'll both have legendaries. Yep. Well, I say that, and we will. I, 
Uh, it's going to be such a mind game whether we send a legendary into the battle or not. Because if we do, one of us loses a legendary. If one of us does, someone's pretty much got free t items or TMs on a legend. Yes. Which then right. gives that legend a, a really big advantage over the other legend in the next match. Unless there's obviously type effectiveness or not. Yeah. Oh, it's got recovered. I kind of hope for both of our sakes there it, we don't have that situation where... Um, like, it's really obvious. Like, let's say you get Articuno yeah. and I get a Celebi. Yeah. It's, it's just like, okay, well, you are just going to beat me. And yeah. it's, I kind of hope it's not that, like, it, for, for me either, just so it's yeah. a bit more interesting. Yeah, you want something like, like, oh, fair. like a Suicune and the Kyogre where there's no type advantage there. It's just like, right, what have you kind of got at your disposal? Which is the better mod? Yeah. That's kind of what you want, isn't it? Something that's like a bit like, oh, what's going to happen? Don't know. Oh my god, that did nothing. Okay, uh, let's go for the Dragon Breath. That did nothing. Um, I'm healing. And I'm speeding up. Oh, you got a Kingdra? Oh, jeez. That's fine. Look, Jeff, Jeff, is a, Jeff is a bit of a monster. Uh, yeah, to be fair, Kingdra hasn't got any decent attacking moves. It's That's one of the reasons why I've not used Kingdra in my Nuzlocke is because it's got... Mm. It get, gets nothing. It's useless. Um, what am I going to do against this mon? Um, Jeff is literally about to solo Koga, and he is like, he's he, and he was level thirty nine when this started. What an absolute wow. legend! Okay, I'm getting nowhere in this battle, so I'm gonna oh, I'm gonna need to speed up just. I'm telling you, there are obviously because I have. Um, Oh, I knew you'd do that. Uh, because I have, like, so many good items, like leftovers and the lucky egg. I'm like, oh, man, I really want some good items on my, on my on team. On your team. I, I, can, yeah. I completely understand that. I, I mean, I think TMs is always the first one that you want. Is it like, TMs, like, yeah, that's really good. But then for yeah. the final fight, those items, like, if you've got, le you've got leftovers, haven't you? Yep, left yep. like, and Jeff is bulky. He's got a lot of HP, and he's bulky. Like, lefties on him is very good. That Jeff scares me. Absolutely freaking. I've got cr the Crunch TM. Oh, oh my, my Lord. days! <gasps> and everyone can learn it. Oh, that's broken. Oh, if you you have that on Tyranitar. Tyranitar, le a... Tyranitar learns it on its own. I don't need to use it. Yeah, but it, yeah, but it, he doesn't learn it. Like you say, he doesn't learn no. that until quite late I on. Think it, I, I think it's 61 he gets it. But still. Actually, it'd be really good on Absol. It would be absolutely amazing on Slicey Dicey over here. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, okay. Dude, and you've got an, you've got an x Cloud with Stab Hyper Beam. Hmm. Yeah. Oh my days. Okay, this again. Now I'm like really nervous again. We're coming up to the, this is going to be a long episode. We're just about to come up to the 40 minute. Right. Mark. Okay. Do you want to wrap it up and we'll see them in the uh, cage yes. match? Yes. Uh, let me. I'll just speed through Koga while he's talking. Let me just quickly check my TM because okay. I might want to teach this to someone. Well, I'll tell you what. Then, do you want to rolling let's, kick? Let's. What I was going to say. Oh well, they no. can't learn anyway. What I was going to say actually. Doesn't really matter this time, but like next time we should probably like end the episode and then do a bit of preparation in terms of like looking at TMs. Otherwise, it might sway the other person. Yeah, true. Good point. Right. Take it anyway, out ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you for watching this episode. I hope you're ready for the cage match. If you're in the premiere right now, start getting some hype in the chat. And this is the final from us from this episode. Of course, we'll see you over there ringside. Until then, yeah. <laughs> are you, okay. How are you feeling, dude? You know how what? are you feeling? I'm, I'm about to click it set, but I am really nervous. But I've, I've kind of chosen me a mod. I'm just going to go for it. So, you ready? Okay, good luck. Good luck in advance. Yeah, let's do let's this. Go. I have no idea who you sent out. Oh. I'll oh. Oh, oh, oh. Why did you send out sevens? What? What? I did not predict you doing nine tails. <sighs> okay. I that was not an option. Why did you go out into nine tails? Um, I I have a re no. I have a reason, and I'm not telling you why I went out to nine tails because it might come in handy in a later fight. Okay, right. Come on, flamethrower. I up speed. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, thank God. Oh, I'll take the W. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Wait, wait, what just happened? Uh, 
What do you mean? You have a Nine Tails with Flamethrower? I so I got a Vulpix in Pewter City. No, not Pewter City, Viridian City when I was fishing. I before Koga, I went and got a Firestone. I evolved it. It's just got it's got Flamethrower on it naturally. You're right there. Oh, you're right. <laughs> All that planning this morning. What? And oh, do you know how, how much of a kick in the teeth that is? Is if I hadn't have said about Viridian City, you would never have gone. No, nope. you would never have had this. No, I, I, I wouldn't have. So were you always gonna go into sevens into the Megalia? Yeah. Why? I know it's you've got strength on it. So when I pointed out, like I thought I saw a HM being used, that's what that was, wasn't it? Yeah. Because I'm I'm huge power, and what? I have a I have I have a plus I have a plus attack nature. Jesus, that's broken. N yeah, and uh I had reflect. So basically, I damage calc everything, and because you have a load of physical hitters and yeah. Exploud, Tyranitar, um, Salamence, I walled all of them. Right. All I had to do was put up a reflect. Yeah. Um, I gained I gained one level this episode, which is all I needed to learn synthesis. So all I had to do was Christ. put up a reflect, synthesis back, synthesis, synthesis the health back up, and strength three code, three or four code all of your team. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, you know what? I might as well tell you why I went into Ninetales, simply because you will have seen it in the... Um, in the live stream, and your subscribers will probably point it out. Its ability is water absorb. I thought you were going into the lantern again to get held items on it. So that's why. So when I got the Vulpix, I was like, oh yeah, I'll just whack a fire stone. And then when I saw it was water absorb, I literally just clicked straight off nine tails. And that completely changed my game plan as to who I was going into. And <sighs> the only the only reason I evolved it is when British earlier on in the comments section said. Oh, you should have got the nine tails because it, it has confused Ray and, and all this. And I was like, oh, go on then. So like when when I got the Vulpix, I was like, I might as well use a Fire Stone. Let's evolve it. What's the worst that can happen? It, it's a mon that I'm not going to use anyway. Like whoop de do, but at least I can I can do species uh, claws. But British GG, you finally won a cage match. <laughs> I Tommy actually I don't think it's your count because you didn't give it its nickname. So. <laughs> Technically, that's an illegal cage match, and I I get the win. <laughs> no, oh no, fair play. No, thank good, you, like thank fair you. play. That you played that well. Oh. I I'm a little bit heartbroken, not because I've lost the Meganium. I I wasn't lying. I like I don't, I don't yeah. and I don't like Meganium, but yeah, like I like I I had genuinely thought about this all day, and I had arrived on that conclusion that Meganium was a free win. To be fair, and the fact that I'm looking back at turn one. You did 40% of my health in one attack. Yes. That's broken. Yep. Oh, it's, oh. That's the thing. As soon as, like, I'm not going to lie. I, I can't believe. Oof. I cannot believe you had Flamethrower. You have Ember. I win that unless I don't hit myself. I mean, yes. it's still a bit hacks because obviously I hit myself on the yeah. second turn. And yeah. if I don't, and then I, but then I would have to crit. But, but to, oh man, yeah, yeah. To be fair, oh, oh, my flamethrower was a critical hit as well. I didn't notice that. Oh, was it? Yeah, I yeah, was just reading back turn three. The opposing sevens lost seventy eight percent of its health. Uh, critical oh. hit, so it was a crit as well. So, oh, but it, it's. I mean, the Willow Wisp was, and also you landed Willow Wisp. Yes. That's only like a seventy. Yes. Yeah. I mean, well, to be fair, obviously that cuts my attack in half. Well, that's why I did it because I, I wasn't going to use Willow. I was like confused, Ray. Then just go straight for flamethrower. When I saw he had strength, I was like, well, strength is a physical move. I can I can just halve that in a, in a single Willow Wisp if I land it. That battle could have gone. Thinking about it, I like winning that battle. I was like, oh, that was that was easy. But looking back, I I might have missed the Willow Wisp. I might not have gotten the, the critical flame for Owe. Suddenly, that completely shifts the balance where, you know, two, two more strengths and I'm knocked out. That, oh, oh Jesus. I'm, I'm so relieved, though, after after losing Heracross. I, oh, to, to win that. I mean, GG, GG, though, like, you, the way you. No, no, good game. The way you no. plan that out, though. That it, but that's the thing about cage matches. Anything can happen. Like you plan, you do all this. This is exactly what we said. Like I like all of my planning. I feel was spot yeah. on. Like mm -hmm. if you like, I was I was 
90% certain you were going into X Cloud. Yeah. Because you that's fully evolved, hyper beam. Yeah. And pretty much yeah, like oh god. Oh no. Oh no. And also cuz I was kind of banking on either that going down, uh Tyranitar going yeah. down or Salamence going down. Yeah. And now of course you've got all of them and now on nine tails with whatever you decide to give it. I'm guessing TMs. I I I don't um, I, I've not really thought no, no, you don't have to. Don't worry, you don't have to say it right now. But no. oh, dude, I like no, that's the thing. I'm just, oh, Jesus. It, I, and I, I guess I, I can't think like this, but I'm so annoyed. I I actually said, oh, we can go get more encounters. Because if you hadn't, if you hadn't, yeah. I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I yeah. feel well. You don't again. You don't have to say, but I'm gonna feel like you definitely would have gone into one of the ones I was predicting. If so, if I hadn't have done that, I would have gone into. I wouldn't have gone into one of the ones that you said, but I. Sizzle? No. I, sizzle I, I, was. Oh, fair so, play, fair Sizzle, play. I'm not sending in Sizzle because I was full swipe. I, sizzle is one of those mons where I don't even know if I'll use it for the final fight, but just catching mons. Full swipe. Fair full enough. swipe is perfect. I'm not risking that. I'm not risking the Tyranitar. They, they are two mons that I do not need to, to risk. I just for me my my plan is was just to get through this battle just because then it opens up and we have legendary encounters we have more um, mons on on the seas and whatnot so I I just needed to get through this but I'm I'm feeling quite good now I mean but at the same time it's not like you've lost a mon that was a core component for your Nuzlocke team. Oh, no, no, no. Dude, this thing was level 24. Yeah. Like it was no position to go and also like I wasn't even certain on what I was going to give it. I was actually just considering on giving it items so yeah. I could whack the EXP share on it and not yeah. actually use it, but just give it some residual experience yeah. in the background. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. No, as in, yeah, no, again, like, the, I'm gutted, but I'm just gutted because I've got another loss. And the plan, the, the plan, it's, it, okay, you, right, it tends to be whoever has a, whoever apparently has a plan <laughs> loses. Yeah. But no, but yeah, it's not just that. I've won every. It's the channel. It's the channel. Exactly. <laughs> My channel, you win. Right. So next cage match. My channel. Oh, it probably won't. Uh, oh, it might. It might. It, it might be on your. Mm, it is. Next cage match, and also if. Oh, let's go. I want to do the next episode already. <laughs> let's, let's do it. Right. Take us out of here, Tommy. I, uh, gang, if you're watching this in the premiere, like you, you probably already said how you felt wow put ggs for both of us don't forget to leave a comment as well if you're watching this as a standard video like and subscribe to myself and of course subscribe to professor hoen um we play we both played a good game yeah gg he Definitely. has come out on top of this and i hope you understand both of our thought processes the next cage match is gonna be mental <laughs> as we will both have legendaries as options. Oh. I've been your main man, Tommy Lou. Professor Hoen has just been chilling over there on the I have on the winner's side tonight. Relaxing. And we will see you in the next episode. Yeah. See ya.